this is cute girl i'm on here doing a quick video for you guys just to show you some items that i recently hauled from sleek cosmetics now i love sleek cosmetics i love their blushes and i even love their eyeshadows okay so i decided to take advantage of their sale that they recently had and i picked up a pressed powder which is tropical bronze this is it here and compact it has a mirror this is the shade here I will admit that it's kind of hard to see what shade you are online so I just really took a gamble um, I can still wear this powder but it's very I'm, I'm pushing it okay but this is it here again this is tropical bronze I also decided to pick up their eyeliner because I've been I like the packaging so I was just like you know what, let me try this okay this is their liner here and this is called um, dip it it's called a dip it eyeliner and let's see I believe it has a felt tip yeah it has a felt tip applicator you guys so yeah I like uh, liners with felt tips so this is going to be great okay so yeah very cute packaging right okay so the next item that I purchased of course I purchased this before in the past but you know I think that this particular duo is a little bit darker because at one point I used to use this in my crease and now if I use it in my crease it's like I'm gonna have a, a smoke <laughs> so um this is it here the face contour kit and it's in dark and as you can see sleek they kind of updated their packaging so yeah this is it here so little it's really small it's like fits in the palm of my hand and it's the dark face contour kit and this is what it has it has like a highlighter and this is a contour shade which is great for contouring but it's not going to go on my crease but i used to wear the original one because i guess they darken the shades because you know I'm, at one point they had like those cream contour kits and the darkest wasn't the darkest uh contour kit but they made a darker so I'm thinking maybe they just lined up their shades and I don't know. I think I need the medium kit, but I'll try to work with the with the um, with the uh, darker contour color and highlight because I don't think the highlight is going to highlight anything on me. See, it's not going to highlight anything, but I'll use it, you know. It'll be like a little blush or something. I don't know. But the next item I'm going to show you guys is going to be the Eye Define palette. And this is in here. Nautical Collection. Wait till y'all see this palette. Y'all see why I picked it. Okay, here's the palette here. Very nice packaging, right? Okay. Y'all ready for these shadows? Y'all ready? Of course, it comes with these you know, applicators. So, here are the shades. Look at this palette. Y'all know I'm going to have fun with this palette. For real. Look at those shades. Let's see. Let's watch this blue. And let's watch this green here. Oh, yeah. Okay. This one here. Very pretty, you guys. Yeah. Still got it on the back of my hand. This is a nice palette. I like these shades because I love my blue eyeshadows. I love my green shadows. And it also offers some like taupey like silver shadows here too. So yeah, I'm, I'm definitely going to get a, a lot of use out of this palette. Like seriously. And again, this is the Nautical Collection. And it's called The Calm Before the Storm. See here. Okay. So I picked up one more palette. You know, I was thinking about getting the Pastel Golf Palette, but then I was like, I don't know. I don't know if they were going to work for me as far as the shade. So I was looking around on Instagram, trying to find me a, um, a palette that would offer some type of pastel colors in it. You know, because the only pastel palette I have, you know, that's, that's that, what, 252 palette my Coastal Sense that I'm about to get rid of. And then them Hot Pots are getting old too, so I'm... I'm going through hot pots too. But I got this particular palette, you guys. Here it is. Snapshots palette. So, yeah. So this is what it looks like. Of course, same palette packaging. Look at that. So I got me some pastels. I got this nice blue here, which I can't wait to use. 
I got some purples, pinks, and got some orange shades. Now, this is a nice pastel, like a cantaloupe color. And this nice, pretty purple here. And the green. And I really, really like this particular color here. This is so pretty. This one right here. This one has like some shimmer in it. Look at that. Ooh, that is so pretty. And so let me swatch the that mint green one. Dang. And that's that pastel color. And I'll go ahead and swatch the pink. So you know the pinks, they gotta be able to show up, okay? That was kind of patchy, but really pretty. You could use that in your transition. And let's see, what else could I swatch? Let's swatch this nice little odd color here that really doesn't belong in the palette. Swatch that. Oh, that color definitely belongs in this palette because it is a pretty shade and I can see myself wearing it on the lid. That is beautiful. It's just like a, I don't know how to describe it, but it's like a russet color. It's beautiful. So I can't wait to wear that. But that concludes my Sleek Cosmetics haul. I need to order some more things from them because um, I'm decluttering and I need some more blushes. So the blushes got to go because, you know, you can only keep blushes for so long. So, so I'm getting rid of those and buying uh, me some more. But I really do like the items that I purchased today. You know, even though that contour kit was a little too dark for me. I'm going to still make it work, okay? So if you guys have any questions or concerns, let your girl know. Again, this is a brand that, you know, I've been using for the last, how many years? Four or five years? I've been using Sweet Cosmetics for a long time, and I actually do like them. So again, if y'all have any questions or concerns, let your girl know. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching, and you guys have a great day. Bye.